Hey everyone, I'm Hursania from Simply Learns team and I welcome you all to this interesting session on the first C program. But before we begin, if you haven't subscribed to our channel already, make sure to hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon so you'll never miss any update from Simply Learn. Without further ado, let's get started with the agenda for today's session. As a part of the first C program, let us execute a simple hello world program and a program to perform arithmetic operations such as addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. So with this, let's get started. To run the programs, we will use VS Code Editor. First, let's name the file with .c extension. Go to File, click on Save As, and name the file with .c extension. And to execute first C program hello world, let's include the header file. Hash include htdio.h. In C programming, hash include is used to direct the compiler to load the header file in the program. Htdio.h is a header file that stands for standard input output. Various functions such as printf, scanf are defined in standard input output header files. Next, void main. Main is a function from which every C program execution begins. And void specifies that a function does not return a value. Curly braces indicates the body of the main function, that is the start and end of the statement. Inside the main function, let us print hello world. So for that, printf function is used to print the output. Printf hello world. And semicolon at the end of the statement indicates that the current statement is terminated. Now let's save the program, control plus s. And let's run it. As you can see here, Hello World is printed successfully. Let's try to execute one more program using arithmetic operators in C to get hands on with it. So, for that, let us declare and initialize variables inside the main function. That is int a is equal to 10, comma b is equal to 10, comma c. You can name the variables and assign values as per your needs. Now let's perform the addition operations on variable c and b and store the result in c. c is equal to a plus b. Using printf function, let's display the value for addition operation. Printf a plus b is equal to percentage d comma c. Whatever is inside the double quotes will be displayed as an output. And percentage d is the format specifier used to display the integer value of variable type int. And backslash n is called an escape sequence which denotes the new line character. Now let's perform the other arithmetic operations one by one on the same variables a and b. c is equal to a minus b. And print a function to print the result of subtraction. Next, let's multiply using multiplication operator. C is equal to A into B. Print a function to display the result of multiplication. 
and then division c is equal to a divided by b let's save the program control plus s and run it The results for arithmetic operations are printed successfully. As you can see here, a plus b that is 10 plus 10 is equal to 20. Next, a minus b that is 10 minus 10 is equal to 0. And then 10 into 10 is equal to 100. And a divided by b that is 10 divided by 10 is equal to 1. So with this, we have come to the end of this session on the first C program. I hope this session was informative and interesting. Until next time, this is Sanya from Simply Learns team signing off. Thank you, stay safe and keep learning. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.